Mexico, duh. <sighs> no, nobody is chasing us. Not yet. Emergency. This is an all points bulletin for every unit in the area. Multiple prisoners, two adults, and two teenagers have escaped from the El Rey police station. They are considered armed and dangerous. Two teenagers? Daniel's like seven. Nine, we, maybe. We still going to Mexico? Yeah. We got nowhere else to go. God damn it. I wonder if you had killed them if no one would have put out the call. Sean. Killed who? It's the 4th of July. Our first one without dad. Oh, yeah. You're right. Remember? Oh, God. Oh, no. He was so in the fireworks every year. Dad was proud to be an American, so wasn't he? Early, so we could get a good spot. Hello, Allison. Thank you for the water. He is so corny. Oh, the second two. This country. Yep. Because. Now they're not going to want to leave. Oh. Shit. They're conflicted. I can feel it. Yeah, dudes, what did you think? Jesus Christ. Yeah, just get closer. That seems like Sean. We, we can can't still leave just because her dad had a misguided view of the country. Sean Diaz, it's over. Don't make this worse. Uh, well, no, I think between that and the conversation and in the jail cell of like how hard it would be. I think it gives Sean a lot to think about. And I don't think it is, it's misguided because it is safer in a lot of ways, safer. And, you know that day? Well, not, not safer in a lot of ways, but. The day dad was shot. I think about it every day. And I would give anything to change what happened. But I can't. I'm sorry for my mistakes. I tried my best. I swear. Sean. But you were the one with the real power, and you know how to use it now. You're not a kid anymore. If we surrender, they will separate us, Daniel. And if that happens, promise me that you will be strong, be brave. I am not ready to make a decision. And I know, like you already are. Don't say that. Let's just get out of here. Please, don't make any more mistakes. Whatever happens, always remember that you're Daniel Diaz. I hate promises. I'll try. So, how does the story of the Wolf Brothers end?
I don't fucking know. I feel like as an older brother, Sean should surrender. So fucked up because he didn't... I feel like if we're so mad at Finn for abusing Daniel's power... If we surrender, then sh then Daniel can have a life. Yeah. Hi. I swear to God, if they shoot him, their story ends right here. What? No. No. Daniel, come on. So we went all this way? All that shit? For nothing? You told me we were going to Mexico. You said... We're done. The end. It's not who we are. Now it's my turn to take care of us, Sean. Everything will be all right. I promise. What? Daniel! No! Stop! Shoot! Shoot! Hold the So I feel like that was a lose-lose. Maddie, I love you. Good morning. <sighs> oh. Um. That did not happen to you, Ren? <laughs> He surrendered in mine and went to jail. Till he was in his late, but he lived. Oh, fuck. So I fucked up. <laughs> oh, that hurts. It 
It must have been cougar pasta related. It must have been related to all the moments of like telling Daniel when to use his power, like not maybe not being like six years after the events at the border. So he would be 15. Oh no. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like, um, either way... Either way, I fucked things up for Sean. I didn't- I didn't even get Sean laid! Lighter. Yeah, he does. <laughs> it all comes back to me not skinny dipping in the lake. I didn't get Sean the story he deserved. Sean gets robbed. Justice for Sean. Oh no. What the fuck? No, 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 no. Please, how does he have the money to upkeep blonde hair? You gonna cougar them? Did I let Sean get a little? Oh my god. No, buddy. No, Sean, don't do it. Oh god. Daniel, no. God damn it. Why don't I ever remember their names? His villain origin story. God fucking damn it. I didn't get Sean the story he deserved and Daniel is 